Hello, technical video instructions how to use the original Turbo Decoder Advanced version with the key profile HU83 locks for Peugeot and Citroën. This is the decoder with our company logo, serial number and model and our websites. With this tool you will receive a couple of uh, setup devices with marked HU83 and uh, I will show you step by step how to reset the pins and how to apply the opening procedure. We have a key blade here, tension wheel, pin access wheel and pump wheel. When you rotate the back wheel to the left, you can see that the pins rise up and down and when they get the code, make it possible to open the lock, turn left and right. To reset the pins, you have to push forward this ring, go all the way to the right with the back handle and by use the calibrated needle you have to go in every single hole at the side of this key blade. Just inject that needle and push it. The shoulder of the needle will stop automatically and uh, the point of the needle will pull the pin in start, in start position. You have to do that on four holes on one side and three holes on the other side and that is the reset procedure. Now if you pull back this wheel you can see that all the pins are in a maximum high position and this is your start point. Now the locks. I will show you the procedure of a couple of locks. One is 2014 and the other one is 2007. It means that it's a long range of years that those cars use HU83 profile. Now we have two ways to insert the tool like this or oppositely, which is the correct one. Just stay in rotation here, all the way to the right, and this to the front. Keep the tool on the middle ring and carefully insert it all the way into the lock. When you touch the bottom of the lock from here, push forward. And if you see that specific movement, it means that your device is not correctly orientated. You just have to make click like this and then extract the tool from the lock. Reverse, insert again, touch the bottom, check, if nothing happened you are ok and you can start the procedure. Two fingers here, pull back that ring and you will see three stop sectors, they are important for your procedure. You have to apply tension to the right and start to take the back wheel to the left. Keep the tension, go to the left till the line of the back wheel go to the first stop sector, here. Now turn back completely and lose the tension a little bit. And again, tension, come to one, turn back and lose the tension. You have to repeat that specific movement for 20 times if no opening happened in 20 pumps you have to increase the rotation of the back wheel and point here in the middle and you have to stay for 20 more pumps in that stop sector if no opening happened also here you have to increase the rotation of the back wheel till the line come to the last stop sector and make it 20 or 10 pumps there. If you miss the opening, you have to extract the tool, reset the pins and try again. 
in my case it's open at one that because the code of that lock is easy and uh, the lock is original of course and for that reason I open at one but there is a difficult locks where you have to follow all three stop sectors 20 on one 20 in the middle and 20 or 10 in the in the last number here in order to complete the procedure once you finish uh, the procedure to extract the tool you have to turn completely at the right the back wheel and stay in neutral lock position not turn it neutral and push forward this middle wheel when it's go into the tension wheel only now you can extract the tool there is no other way to extract it if you forget to push this forward the tool will remain in the lock and you cannot extract it just click like that that must be all the way to the right and you can extract pull back now come to one to see the pins now you can see that the pins have changed their position by follow the code diagram of that lock if you want to open another lock you have to reset the pins and go to open if you want to use that tool for the ignition lock discover the orientation of the ignition insert and pull back and found the position only by give tension lose tension and found the position of that line somewhere in that sector you will turn also the ignition or you can manipulate it directly if the door is damaged or something if you not reset the pins you will have uh, because you have the code imprinted on that lock you can turn it immediately the two react like a key reset push forward go to the right and again go in every single hole and uh, push the pins there is no other way for you to reset the tool that is the only way for reset your device let's take the next lock again check the orientation no extract reverse and insert check you're okay and again you can try also this tension to the right pump to one call back tension to the left one and back you can repeat left and right tension but stop at one every time there is another way to make uh, that procedure if you fail in that way turn uh, on the previous way and it's work also fine extraction is neutral right front and extract let's see the pins in that in that lock come to one and you can see so if you have a trident a and if you can read the key by look at it for example this is one hu 83 if you can read the key you can read also the decoder basically the pins stay in code position and if you remember when you reset the tool you put the pin in that position so this pin is cut number one you see that this that is more deeper than the first one this particular pin has cut number three and here you have a reference lines you can read also from the lines it's enough for you to push a little bit forward and you can see the lines and see the point of the pin in what line stay it's very easy this angle here is 
the cut number one. The first line is cut number two. The second line cut number three. The third line is cut number four. And the order for read the pin is first from the handle, this one. Then that is the first pin. Second is on the other side. Third pin is again on that side. And that is the order for read. Not in line and then in line. Just left, right, left and right and so on. If you have a CNC cutting machine, you can insert that code and cut the mechanical key. That is the way you have used the original turbo decoder device. Thank you for watching that video.